Hi, this is Kim Redding with Y Denton, and I'm here with Chris at Edge of the Lake Winery over in Valley View, Texas. Um, thank you for joining us. Yes, of course. Well, if you don't mind, tell them a little bit about your winery and a little bit about how it came to be. Okay. Um, so we sit on 100 acres here on Lake Ray Roberts, um, and we've our oldest vines are 12 years old. Um, but we decided to really make this a business about four or five years ago. Um, and we just celebrated our one year anniversary being open to the public. Um, on the estate, we have just under 15 acres planted and we specialize in Spanish varietals. So we grow Albarino, Tempranillo, and Grenache. Um, we've just kind of been enjoying the year and taking it all in. All in. We've uh, enjoyed a pretty successful first year. It's been fast and, and busy, and, right. and we're looking forward to the future. Of it. We are too. We've heard yeah. really good things about you. And then you have another one you just told me coming up in bourbon barrels. Uh -huh. Did I said it wrong. Can you tell us about that one? Yeah, so um, we do a Tempranillo aged in Iron Root uh, Republic mm -hmm. bourbon barrels. Um, that wine is aged f uh, originally for eight to nine months in, on French oak, and then it's mm -hmm. finished in bourbon barrels. Last year, that month, that wine sold out in a month and a half, okay. and so everybody's been steadily awaiting the new release of it, and we'll be releasing it later in April. Oh, good. Yeah. Can I ask you, do you have a favorite wine? I do. Okay. Um, you know, we always thought, and everybody says Tempranillo is, gonna, is your flagship in Texas, right. and um, all the vines you guys drove in, that's Grenache, both east and west, okay. and um, our Grenache is probably my favorite wine that we do here. All right. And my wife will tell you, and I'm starting to believe her, that the reason she married me is because of that Grenache. Oh, really? So, yes. Okay. <laughs> I'll have to try that one. That's great. All right. So people, what do they expect when they come in here? So what can they expect? Okay. Um, so we're a full service um, at the table um, facility. Mm -hmm. um, our, our main goal here is to uh, introduce people to not only Texas wine, but wines from the Texoma AVA. Mm -hmm. Um, we take great care in pouring each wine by hand um, so that we can take time to explain the ins and outs of each wine or varietal as it may be, mm -hmm. um, answer any questions, um, and everything is taken care of by us, which is all family. Right. Um, and you can tell that here. It's just you feel like family is when you come in. Yeah. And then so you can be from beginners to experienced wine. Yeah. You know, and just learn about it yeah. from the beginning. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's great to know. And then, so how would they find you? Um, so we're on Facebook, mm -hmm. um, the Facebook page is Edge of the Lake Vineyard, um, and also our website is edgeofthelakevineyard.com. Okay. Um, you can always, at, at either location, we'll have our reservation email and our phone number. All right. Um, we do recommend that people make reservations for a tasting. We, only, right. we only offer tastings inside. Rec uh, reservations are not required, but they are highly recommended because okay. we do get busy. And what are, what are your out days and hours that you're open? We are open Friday and Saturday from 1 to 7. All right. And Sunday from 1 to 5 currently. Sunday from 5. Okay. All right. Now, your backstory. So why Denton, Denton County? Why do you live here? So um, I grew up in Denton. Um, I graduated from Denton High School at Billy Ryan Campus, yeah. um, last graduating class of the right. old Denton High. Um, my, f my father, who is my partner in this mm -hmm. project, is a practicing physician in Denton. Okay. Um, his name is Dr. Cummings. He's been practicing there for 40 years, so right. we are pretty engulfed in the community. Right. I always joke that I swore I would never move back to Denton, and I like to think I kept my promise because I drove right past it. And went and, to Valley And went to Valley View <laughs> instead. Um, yeah. But we are, we are deeply involved in our community, both in chambers and, right. and other, other committees and associations as well. And so we're just happy to be a part of it. I know a lot of people that have said as they grew up, they're not going to come back. And so many people have brought their, their after they've done everything, they've come mm. back to Denton and yeah. said, I'm, I, I understand and I've been back and, and it's just a sense of community. So thank you for coming back. Yeah. Thank you for taking the time to open this and that your dad planted some grapes 12 years ago. Right. So this is going to be a good experience. And yeah. um, one last thing, if they were to come in, um, how many people could fit? Like, could they do a party? Can they have like gatherings here? Do you recommend that? Or like teacher night, nursing, you know, like different groups coming in? Yeah, so um, we, we do offer some different packages for groups, okay. just depending on the size of it. Um, anything that's over six is definitely requires a okay. reservation. That's good. Um, we have some areas that we rent out, like our screen porch area. Oh, okay. 
Um, and we do offer some uh, ability to do things on off hours or off days. Okay. Um, if you know, if the need arises. Okay. Um, but as far as expecting to come out here and just enjoy great wine and yeah. some great food options and and be a part of our family. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks again. Thank you for watching Why Denton. And remember, as always, you belong here.